Hey guys, Christopher Smith here with LeBlanc. We're going to talk today about our belts, how to replace them. We get this a lot, especially with the timing belt and cog belt. So, with your main drive belts, what I've been taught and shown, I'll get that in a second, is I use a shop towel. You're going to want to put your lathe into neutral. Wrap your towel around the belt. And then just whip it up and pull it off, just like that. I'll go ahead. Make sure to keep your fingers on the outside of the towel so you don't get them caught in the pulley, especially on the back side when you've got one that has the five belts. Like you're just going to keep going back and forth and pulling it over until it pops off. Now to get them back on, This machine's equipped with four, four belts. So I'm going to stick my, I always start with the small pulley first, stick the bottom on, then just get it up there. Work it over. And you want to make sure you get it where the belt is not twisted. Here we go with that one. Get going there until we're done. Now, something you might find is with your new belt, it may be pretty tight. And if that's the case, too, oval of one lays, the motors are on a plate. And you can move in and out so you can keep good tension on your belts. So your old belts might have been stretched out. And someone adjusted the plate down. So with your new belts, if they're tight, you're going to have to bring your plate back up. And get it to where you have no more than one inch deflection when you push on it like this. Now if you're a cog belt or a timing belt, patience is the key here. Need that Allen wrench to drop. You're going to take the end cover off. Slowly work it off. There we go. Now to get it back on, I start at the top. And I keep it out towards the end. Then I come down and make sure that my teeth line up. Once I get it going, then I can slowly work it on just like so. Replace the cover. And we're back up and running again. If you have any questions on that or want to see anything else that we can help uh, help you through, please let us know at leblondeusa.com. We're always here and happy to help. And uh, we'll see you next time.